A Folsom mother's heartbroken after her late son's plaque was stolen near where he died two years ago in a car crash. I spoke with her tonight to help get the word out. She told me there are a few silver linings she's holding on to for hope. He was just, just a really good person. You know, and I miss, I miss him a lot. Cindy Bohard often checks this tree on East Natoma Street in Folsom. It's where a plaque was placed to honor her late son, Josh. It was the day before Mother's Day, and I was running by the tree, and right underneath the plaque was one poppy flower. Cindy says she believes Josh had a hand in that single poppy flower from above. But when she checked the tree Monday, something else stood out. And noticed the memorial plaque was gone, and then there had also been a, a metal heart that was kind of in front of the tree as well, and it was gone. Cindy decided to call Folsom Police. The officer that responded was the same officer first on scene at her son's accident. And 15 minutes later, knock on my door, and there he was. Cindy finally got to formally thank the officer that went above and beyond for her and her family two years ago. Not only was he the first on scene, he also helped find Josh's glasses. That meant so much to Cindy. Without hesitation, he drove out to the junkyard where the car was, searched through the car, found them and showed up at my door. And another full circle moment that happened today. When I think was six or eight dollars or something like that. It's exactly like, four it's years to the date. ABC 10 did a story with Josh and his mom, Cindy, when Josh bought an old camera with vintage film still inside. So that was pretty amazing to me, the timing of how that happened. Cindy says what stands out today are the silver linings and the messages from above. I can get another plaque. I can put another one on the tree. Um, but what came out of this today was so much more valuable.